Where do I begin? Let's see. I guess we'll talk about Cali Muscle. Cali Muscle struck down Kenny K.O.'s channel. Apparently, he didn't like the video or the short that Kenny K.O. did about Cali making fun of water. How water is bad for you because there's salt in water. You know, or drinking water out of bottles is poisoning people. <clears throat> and I think it's kind of fucked up that he decided to strike down Kenny K.O.'s channel. Well, he ain't struck it down. He gave him a community guideline strike or whatever fuck. And so Kenny K.O. can't upload. Now, listen, I'm not a big fan of Kenny K.O. I think Kenny K.O. is one of those individuals that sooner or later is going to get what's coming to him. And we all are. But but Kenny is like the guy that everybody wants to punch when they see him. He's, he, you know, that's he's kind of like a Greg Doucette, right? <clears throat> More on Greg here in the next video. Uh, but... To hear Callie talk about how hard it is and then for Kenny to get a strike and then Kenny to call out, you know, Callie about the strike, uh, it, it, it doesn't look good. Now, be that as it may, okay, I find it ironically fucking stupid that a man that sells supplements is down talking the supplement game, uh, I find it sad that you find it wise and smart where I find it stupid that you believe salt is bad for you and you should avoid salt. I find it stupid that you actually believe that it's smart to just be on an all fruit diet. And I find it stupid that you find it smart to believe, all right, that you're spreading this rhetoric like it's fucking the best thing for anyone to be on. I find it stupid that you find it so smart because it's fucking stupid. I watch your latest video and in your latest video, you're in the gym. I guess that's your, your new client you're training. The, the dude doing half ref ego living on the fucking Smith machine. Injury waiting to fucking happen. I'm not saying you still don't have some strength because you built some muscle. You built the foundation before you got on PEDs. So I'm not saying you don't have strength, but let's Let's get one thing straight. It is essential that you eat from all your food groups, Callie. All five. It's very essential that you get your fats, your protein, your carbs, your micro uh, macros in. It is very important that you do that versus you worry about just eating fruits. Okay? Even people before we were smart enough to cook food was hunting meat. Right? They were catching fish and hunting fucking meat. And you 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 can't change that. That's that's what it is. You can't change that, okay? Now, what I don't understand and what I want you to understand is that the logic that you are pushing, because I read your comment section, there are people that believe this shit. The logic that you are pushing, this notion that you can get away with just eating fruits and be fine is suicidal. Now, you are on TRT. See, you are on all that shit because you fucked your nuts up, all right? So you are getting your dose of testosterone. Therefore, that's one of the reasons why you're not losing muscle at a very fast rate. You're losing muscle, but not at the rate that you should be because you are keeping high levels of testosterone from getting it from the shot, okay? Understand this, if you stop injecting that shit and just eat fruits, your ass is going to shrivel up faster than a goddamn dried up turd in the sun out there in California, out there in the fucking desert, okay? Out there in Death Valley. Understand what I am saying to you. Water is essential. I'm going to tell you how idiotic you sound. 70% of your body is made of water. I wonder why that is. If sodium is bad for you, then how come in your nervous system makeup and in your DNA structure and in the cellular structure of your body, it ain't so much DNA, DNA determines other shit, but still, it's, it plays a factor. How is it that sodium is declared an electrolyte and that the body needs sodium? If the body needs sodium because it's one of the fundamental electrolytes, right? 
Sodium is like the, 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 the primary root for electrolytes, salt. Some good, you sweat it out. You need that more than anything. Potassium, you have a muscle contraction. Calcium and magnesium to help with skin and, and bone health and heart health, right? And sodium chloride, chloride, it's still the same thing. It just chloride is a byproduct of sodium. But the point is, you need salt in your diets. Not high levels of it, but you need enough of that electrolyte so the body can pump, uh, function properly, especially your nervous system. The nervous system. You know, the nervous system that stores at the brain and send nerves throughout your extremities. You need that shit to function properly. Therefore, you need to get all five of your electrolytes. And I'm sorry, fruits ain't gonna provide all that. And do you not know that some fruits you eat has sodium in it? Sodium comes from the ground. You ever been to the ocean? Put your hand out there in the Pacific Ocean. You out on the West Coast. Go out there to the Pacific Ocean. Take your hand and do this here. And then pick it back up and, and suck some of that water and tell me what it tastes like. And then tell me where that salt came from. I drink water daily. The body needs this. It needs this. This is the best thing for detox. Water in the lemon. Water in the orange. But mainly water. This is all you need. With a healthy diet. You don't need to do all that stupid shit. You're doing fruity diets and shit. All that sugar, fructose in them fruits. You set yourself up for an insulin spike. Gonna be hyperglycemic depending on what fruits you're eating. You go fuck around and get diabetes. Oh, what the fuck's gonna happen? The pancreas can't be, ain't gonna be able to produce enough insulin to keep up with the demands of sugar that can be constantly in your bloodstream. And that's just a fact. If you're not exuding a lot of energy, depleting a lot of your sugar stores, you'll need to take all that fructose. You know, like the high corn fructose. Fructose is a sugar that comes from fruits, by the way. Fructose. When you eat them fruits, you're eating fructose. I understand the high corn, sorry, fructose, whatever the fuck. But at the same sense, if you eat vegetables, vegetables are carbs, fruits are carbs. But you need protein. That's the big. You claim you ate meat and fish and shit no more a year? You want us to believe you ain't had no protein over a year. Some of the fruits that you eat has protein in it. May not be a complete protein, but it's a protein, nothing fucking less. Okay? However, you want me to believe that you hadn't you have not had a protein supplement or haven't had any meat at all. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's bull. That, that, that ain't nobody that dumb to believe that. Okay? Nobody. Nobody. Listen. I don't have all the wealth you have, but I'm I'm not wanting for nothing in life, right? I may not be as big as, as you were at your max, and I don't plan on ever getting that big because that's just unhealthy and stupid. But I'm not a weak guy. At, you know, far from that. I'm not weak, okay? Um, coming off injury, strength's going up. Been doing real good for myself. Had a squat session yesterday. Finally squat 225. Doctor told me I'll never lower my back again. I hurt my spine, my cervical spine, and my upper thoracic spine back in August. Guess what? Squat 225 for three yesterday. All right? Actually, I did three more off camera, so I say 225 for six. Far cry from the, from the almost four or five used to squat a couple of years ago. Going on. Well, actually... Been about 15 months since I squatted four or five, but for the most part, squatting 315, 320, that was, that was wild. We used to stay at it's been a while, but I'm going back that way. Point is, I don't have to be as big as you to have the knowledge. You need rest and recovery, you need you need the essentials, you need the carbohydrates for energy, you need the protein to help the muscles recover, and you need the fats in your diet to help organ function, to cushion, and the, for skin function. 
to provide cushion and shit for your ligaments, joints, and tendons. That's what fast support you diet for hair health and all that shit, right? Eye health, heart health. That's that's what fats are for, okay? I know you're not going to listen to reason. I know you're going to keep calling us haters. And I know you're just doing it for content. But listen, man. We all going to gonna have to meet our end. Okay? I just hate it when we see a person on a highway straight to hell. Right? Or to, straight to the dead end. Right? Straight to the graveyard. And you're seeing it in real time. You might feel good now. Okay? And, and like I said, I, I believe... There's a lot of you doing off camera that you're that you're not uh my certificate's gonna fall down that you are not saying or, or showing. That's what I believe, and I could be wrong. I pray that I, I am uh fucking wrong, and you are doing shit off camera that you don't want nobody to see. Like I eat eating some meat, right? Because I I, I nobody wants wants to make a video. Cali Muscle dead. Uh, he died from from uh. You can't really say a heart attack if you're not really putting a lot of meat in your diet. You're not really clogging up all your arteries, but still the same sense. You got stents in your chest and shit. You're supposed to be on some type of statin and blood thinner to, to, to help with that, to watch your cholesterol levels. But at, at the end of the day, I would hate to turn it on and say, well, you know, he died from starvation or something like that. You know, he got cat catatonic and died from starvation. His nervous system stopped functioning properly and his heart just stopped. Brain stopped fucking working right because he wasn't giving the brain the, the proper care they needed, which is glucose, sugar, but you get enough fructose, so you're getting the brain the way it needs, but the nervous system as a whole wasn't getting what it needs and the brain needs to function properly. It needs electrolytes to circulate through the nervous system. Anyway, you keep doing you, man. I, I, listen, I seen you do those dumbbells, the 100-pound dumbbells, man, for three reps, four reps, man. Listen, there's no need to go that heavy. You ain't got nothing to prove. Stay in shape. That's my that, that's my best advice is hold on to as much muscle as you can. Because muscle is essential for longevity. Hold on to as much muscle as you can. But at the end of the day, you got to stop this notion that protein, fats, food, certain foods are bad for you. Now, yes, there are certain foods that are bad for you, but what you're seeing is damn near everything is bad for you. If that's the case, then, hey, do what me and my spouse do. Grow our own shit. We're getting ready to, to start another garden here to grow more shit. You know, and we still go to the store, but we prefer to grow our own fruits and vegetables. Grow your own fucking shit. Do, do, do that. Do that. Hope y'all enjoy, guys, and I'm out. Peace.